Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening everyone. I said that three words because I don't know what time you will see this video on YouTube. By the way, how are you guys? I hope you all in good condition when you see this video on YouTube. Anyway, uh, this video is made to complete my final test on my English courses. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for his abundant mercies because of his blessed we can enjoy this video on YouTube. Oh, thanks God. And especially, let's send our salutation and peace to our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu wa sallam, his messengers and his servant. I also would like to thank to my English lecturer, Ms. Dian for asking us to make this video, speech video because it can improve my speaking skill and my confidence level and I hope I can get an A on my assessment on Siakat but before that, I would like to introduce myself my name is Hilmi Yahya, you would call me Hilmi I live in Solo, I am a student of public administration on Spasmart University in this video, I would like to deliver my speech about mental illness, a serious problem which still not be taken seriously by the general public, especially in Indonesia. So, lately, I have been read many news about suicidal attempt on social media, especially Twitter, and mostly it caused by mental illness or we can say mental disorder. Uh, they commit suicide because they got a lot of pressure are often keep their problems on themselves and didn't want to go to a psychiatric for a counsel. Um, many people, our general public, still make jokes for this case and its victim. Many people even think that go to a psychiatric is a weird thing to do. Okay, now let's talk about what mental illness is. Mental illness, or we can say mental health disorders, is a wide range of mental health problems or disorders that affect your mood thinking and behaviors uh, mental illness can make you miserable and causes many problems in your daily life example at a school in the work or in a relationship uh, many people in this world always concerned about their physical or body health and forget about their mentality health this is totally wrong. Uh, we must concern about our past physical and mentality health because we all know there's two things is related. related. Many people still saying that go, that someone who could do a side trick is a crazy and not normal people. For God's sake, this is so awful. Uh, no one, no one will, no one wants to be a called crazy or not normal person. So watch your mouth and start to thinking before you talk because nobody know that your words will affect their victim health or not. There are so many different conditions that are recognized as mental illness. The common types such as anxiety disorders, mood disorders, eating disorders, uh, impulse control and addictive disorders, personality disorders, and etc. And for your information, the most problem, the most people's problem in this world, sleep habits, is included as a mental illness. There are so many signs and symptoms of mental illness uh, depending on the disorders, circumstances, on the other factors. Mental illness symptoms can affects someone's emotion, uh, tough, and behaviors. The example of signs and symptoms include, includes are uh, feeling set and down, extremely mood change, uh, confused thinking and decreased concentrate, and the bad one is suicidal thinking. There's so many causes of mental illness, but usually it causes by environmental factors like a family's divorce or something that he or she loves death, social culture expectation, and the bad ones is a physical or verbal violence 
by their friends or their family so from now be careful with your with our mouth or our words and start to give a protection to the victims if there's any bullying around us if one of your friend or your loved one so sign of mental illness try to give try to make an open and honest discussion with them with your concern you may not be able to force someone to get a professional care but you can offer your encouragement or your support you also can help with find a qualified professional mental health and make an appointment you may even be able to take along with them to the appointment and and if they have done uh, self-harm or are uh, considering doing so take them to the hospital or call emergency help as soon as possible because this is so dangerous there is some prevention if you have a mental illness taking step to control stress to increase your resilience and to boost low self-esteem may help keep your symptoms under control the step that you can follow are first uh, get a routine medical care get help when you need it good, take good care of yourself and tell the person that you trust or your love it can be your family or your friends if you have um, some serious problem on your life well 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 uh, that brings me to the end of my speech about mental illness i apologize if i made a mistake because i only an ordinary boy who tries to be an extraordinary once again i really beg your pardon and i'm grateful for your attention to this video and i want to remind you to start thinking before you talk thank you for your thank you for seeing this video and i hope with this video it can increase our sensitivity and knowledge about mental illness or mental disorder thank you wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh goodbye